So it's day six of Can't Get Online Week and I'm in Morsham in North Yorkshire and I'm with Trevor Watson who's organised the event here. Fabulous event Trevor, loads of people here, lots of passion, I think um, real community spirit and you've been organising people to try and do something about the poor broadband connectivity here. Yeah, that's, that's very true. I think I kind of have got labelled as the broadband champion. Um, I wasn't voted in, but nobody is voting me out, strangely enough. Yeah, I mean, I use broadband. Um, I, I'm a self-employed computer person, and my frustrations are just ridiculous. Downloads, mostly. Um, so I'm being slightly selfish in organising the village, but... It's kind of a community, but selfish as well. Mm. So um, what we've been doing is we've got lots of people across the village are actually doing regular monitoring using the same speed tester. Mm. We've got an online spreadsheet that everybody's entering the data into so that we can actually see across the village the f silly things like um, three doors along from me, it's the fastest speed in the village, they're running at 1.6 meg. Um, that's on average. Um, I'm running, as I say, three, four doors along. I'm running at um, 0.5 of a meg. My next door neighbour is running at 0.9 of a meg. And that's all within the same street. Uh, we've got another re really bad example. Further down the village, off the same telegraph pole on either side of the street, we've got one person running at 200k, 0.2 of a meg and the man opposite is running at 1.2 meg and it's just the same telegraph pole. How crazy is that? So uh, it's just trying to build up that um, data, if you like, to try and hammer people over the head with. Yeah. Okay, so what, what's next then? What are the next steps here? Right, <laughs> next steps is, well, we've done, we, we're doing a few things. We've got our local MP, Tom Blankensop, involved. Mm -hmm. He's hassling um, BT as you would, but I think we're going to bang our head there against a brick wall. But even if in the short term we can get BT Openreach to look at the differences in lines, because it's obviously lines into the village that they need to do something about in the short term. Um, we've got our local councillor and the MP chasing the government's money that's come into the local authority for the broadband but I think we banged your head against a brick wall there. So we're busy now looking for alternative supply from anybody we could find. Um, and that's about where we're at at the moment but I think uh, the, the solution's in our own hands, definitely not in BT's hands. Okay, thank you.